Hey guys, we're Yucky Sonic X here. And we're back. Oops, it went another video. That's my fault. But no, no. Go back to game. Sorry about that, guys. I didn't mean to, to do that. So, first alien up, Heat Blast. You guys already know, Heat Blast's first ability is, well, you guys already guessed it, starting a fire. Yeah. Okay, so his ability is when you hit mobs, you will set things on fire. So if I do it right now, boom, I'm setting a mob on fire. He can go away. Next ability is shooting fire from your hands or fireballs. Yeah, you leave a trail of fire. If you guys are asking, finally you are back. Well, I am back. I don't know what this boot is. It's Fighter Dash. I guess you run faster or something. I don't know what this ability does. Shift. Okay, so next ability is Flying. If you guys know from the series, Heat Blast is able to fly. If I can get it to work, it will let me. Okay, there it goes. So his booty is flying. Yes. <laughs> yeah, I see Blast flying ability. It's pretty cool if you guys ask me. I'm trying my best, guys, not to fuck it up again. Okay, so you guys can see that my Omnitrix is losing power. Ow. Yeah, so this is my gonna be my to-go skin everywhere. This is gonna be my new skin when we are in for the rest of the uh, series I'm gonna do. Until I can get my space down, I can record myself. Next alien is Wild Mutt. Oh, you guys can actually see me. Um, Wild Mutt, so his ability is Punch, Super Sight, uh, 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 Sense, and Slam. For Super Sense, what that is, is, my bad, is that he can detect mob while being blind. You can take moms everywhere. His next ability is slam. And what slam does, you hold it, unhold it, it will make an explosion. Next alien. Hold up, wrong side. So. So if you guys wonder how I'm running running this, it's um if you go into your options, everybody should know. Keep your thing on easy, difficult on easy. When you go to video, if you guys have been wondering, change your uh range distance to two chunks. Yeah. That's how I'm running this. Yeah, so it can be any kind of if you want to forge you're using a mod or something or you're using a pack that shows up light on it then go ahead I don't really care so next alien is diamond head okay. so diamond head abilities are first ability is diamond sword there's also a secret ability so when you press E there's a secret ability on each and every one of these that will be showing up in different colors. And when you use him, 
right click and you will do a diamond shard block next ability is if you guys are in a situation where there's creepers around you shift and you make a diamond wall of glass next ability is you guys already saw you can use a shovel right click he can use a pickaxe right click he can use a diamond axe so yeah you're gonna link the model though. next ability not ability next hero hold on is accelerate Douche. accelerate So, Accelerate first boot is Fast Punch. Second ability is Dash. Third ability is Vortex. So, what Vortex does, it's, um, think of it as Accelerate running so fast in a circle, he makes a black hole. That's what Vortex is. Dash is, like, if you're on water or something, you guys be able to, like, run on it, kind of. You'd be like one inch under it, but you'll be running on water though. It's really cool. Then he also has his own little speed animation where there's blue lightning behind him, like a blue line, and his mass actually goes down. So, like, if I show you guys real quick, you see how I'm kind of like running on water though? See, I'm kind of running on water, but not at the same time. Yeah, that, that was going to be fixed. So, hold up. Yeah. I'm trying to hold my camera while I record. Then runs. His mask would kind of go on if it would go on at all. Yeah, there it goes. And he was kind of doing his, uh... If you guys can't see it, there it is, you, if you guys saw it. And so we're going to get out shoutouts to, um, who, who's the first one? If you guys want shoutouts, leave comments in below if you guys want shoutouts. Oopsie, wrong way. Slash, give, Sonic X, yeah, I'll change my name. Uh, cooked beef. 64. Oh, I already had cooked beef. What am I doing? It should get gain back my health I lost. And yes, the next one we're gonna be reviewing is Alien Force. If you guys can see right here. Yeah, it will show this label on each one. I think. I am there. Click on yeah. So I haven't showed you guys how you craft. Give me a second. So give me one second, guys. Oh, guys, I'm getting the materials right now. Shh. Oh, guys, I'm almost done. Okay, here we go. So guys, I'm back. So the items you're gonna need from Blue Weld Mod, I mean data pack, is a clock, iron ingot, green dye, and lime dye. 
So if you guys have not watched it yet, I, I suggest you guys watch it. If you guys have a good computer, I suggest you guys go play it. It's really fun to play with if your computer is really good. So the first thing we're gonna build is the original object I was just wearing. Then I'm gonna show off the real. So it's one clock, one iron to make the army core. Then to finish it off, one army core and one lime dye. Not lime dye, uh, green, uh, green dye, my bad. So we're gonna save this lime dye for later. I'm gonna show you guys all the aliens. Because some of you guys have requested me to play with the pack, data packs from Blue Whale. Because some of you guys don't have computers and he didn't explain it at all. Next alien is Grey Matter. I'm not gonna like show all the abilities because the video is probably not gonna be that long. Next one is Grimmer. So his abilities are punch, climb, and wrist unplug. What that means is Grimmer's ability is like unplugging redstone and plugging it back in. And he can charge up the redstone. Then his next ability is climb. If there's like a, like you're in New York City in a Minecraft map, you guys can climb on walls. And you can punch things, and you can go through one small block like this. This is how small you are. Next alien. So like I said, I'm not going to show them all. I'm just going to explain how they work. Forms. Okay, forms abilities are, he cannot shift and jump in the air. So I have to explain them. So he has a punch ability, so if I show that off. If it will let me spawn in a villager, here it is. Smack it once, and he's dead. He's one shot. Like I said, one hit. Sorry about that, guys. One. Can I not smack y'all? Hey, get back here. No running. Why I do running? Stop it. Then smack. He's a two shot. Never mind. That he was one shot. This is called smack. Smash. Uh, dash. Is it called that? Smash dash. Yeah, it's called smash dash. So when you're right clicking on it, then when you got it, summon another. These guys. He's a. How are you supposed to be holding? Outside oh, that area, so let's see here. So if I do this, if I keep on clicking. So let me summon another one because I'm getting tired of it. Yeah, so and never mind. Thought that's what it was. Then when you spawned in another one of these guys, hold that, and it'll do a seismic slam. More like a Boom. Yeah. And if you guys are wondering what kind of computer I have, it's a Wonder Ultimate 7. Next alien is Stinkfly. Here's the Stinkfly we all know and love. If you guys are not a Vintage Joe fan from 2005 to 2008, you guys have really messed up. Were you newborns? So his first ability is Punch, second ability is Fly. You just fly in the air. You shift and like right click to get back down. Press them both at the same time. Next ability is called poison gas. He shoots out the uh, slime out of his face or these little tentacle things he has, whatever they're called. And he shoots out this slime, I think, from the show, and he poisons their enemies. So yeah, that's all Sneak Fly has. Next one is Rip Jaws. You guys already know what to do with Rip Jaws. His abilities are punching, super sense, and uh, whatever this is supposed to be for. Oh, let me summon a villager. 
I guess if you guys need something body to dig up something, this would be your guy. And you can also be used underwater. I'm not gonna show that off, but since you guys are fans, I'll show it all. Where would the water be? Over there. Sorry if my game's kind of laggy. I was just in a forest. Where is it? Okay, here's the water. So when you're in water, contact with water, you will instantly transform into his fish form. If you guys can see. Yeah, so he will transform to his fish form. And then when he's out of water, he will transform out of it. Yeah, so I guess it's time I showed you guys the um, other Ami um, drinks. Or you, let me just show you guys. Upgrade can't upgrade a lot of things in Minecraft. You can upgrade a furnace, a brewing stand, a what else? A this player, whatever they're called. He can become a iron golem. He can become a piston. He can become a boat, and that's it. Ghost Freak, he can take over mobs. He can go in spectate mode, go into the ground, and find case uh, uh, systems to find gold and stuff. And to move around, press shift, and you move around. Because he's a ghost, he does not have any legs. So next ability is not ability. Alien, I have to explain. Cannonball. Here we go. Cannonball I love the most. Because his animation looks cool. When you shift, he will do his rolling animation. Next one is uh when you run he'll do that. I guess. Don't know. His first ability is punch, and his second move is cannibal slam. Right click, and he will slam into the ground into his ball form. Okay, hold up. Okay, out of here. Okay, his next ability is called Foxine. Um, what it does is vacuum. What it does is like accelerates ability, but instead of like it's, huh? And um, his next ability, uh, his ability is that when you absorb in uh, villagers, it explodes them to death in Minecraft. It will absorb any mob that is near your location. Like if I walk, I like walk, if I go over there to him and I right click again, it will instantly pull a mob towards you. Like you're in a black hole. But this ability is from Ben 10 Protectors Earth. If you use a certain combo, Cannibal will turn into a ball and there will be tornadoes on each side. And he will uh, turn out of a ball and he will explode. Pretty much. And that's what it does. Next. Abilities. Not abilities, but aliens. Okay, so if you guys can't see, I'll bring it in even closer. So the next, so we're on the same slot. Wild Vine can use things around him like plants or whatever. So let me show you. So his first ability is Punch, Grabble, Grabble, and Poison Bombs. So if you guys have played Ben 10 Protectors of Earth on PS, PSP, the PS Vita, and the PS2 and 3, you guys will understand what uh what this ability is. So what it does that when you right click on this ability, it will explode and it will leave poisonous gas. The next ability is 
gravel. When you look at a wall or something you can attach to, it will hold up. Slash time set day. So what it will do is if I go in first person, because I can't really see, is that when you're near like a wall or something, it will gravel onto it. Like uh, if you're throwing, shut up. If you're throwing a uh, ender pearl, it's like that. But you have to be like really close. It's still being developed. So, yeah. You guys will find out when you guys wanna. Okay. Shift. Click. Right click if you guys wanna uh, go to the next slot. We have Ben Wolf. You guys already know his abilities, but some of you guys don't. So Ben Wolf abilities are like some of these enemies have the same the same abilities as Wild Mutt. So since he's half uh, wolf and dog, he can have uh, super sniff. He also has Sonic Screech, and what that does is that he does this. He'll make a Sonic Screech. You can also break glass with this ability. It's really cool. He has a running animation. Yeah, so that's basically it for him. He cannot climb. Click. Next alien is Ben Vell Drinkenstein. Ben Frankenstein. And his abilities are punch, lightning, and levitate. Well, levitate is it levitates items off the ground, like that villager, wherever he went, I guess I killed him, will levitate. So, this is his electric ability. Right click on any anything that's in the air near you. Oh, you have to shift. There we go. Yeah, so that's his ability. And his third one is levitate. You levitate off the ground. Only for a short amount of time, you will levitate back on the floor. Yeah, so it has a recharge ability, I guess. Yeah. Next alien is Upchuck. 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 What he can do is he has a punch ability, a sp uh, split, or like when he spits out his like little fireball things, and he has a eat ability. So whenever mob he touches with his Eda booty will instantly get withered. The wither effect. And when he's uh what he does is he can do that and it does tons of hits. Tons of hits. Next one is I guy. We have one more slack guys. Um this guy can uh, punch people, lasers, this is his laser, then he has eye multiple, where he will start blinking, his eyes will blink, and he can't see for a little bit, it lasts like two or three seconds. Let's time out. Shift. Look. So, yeah, that's all the builds for select one and two. This is the last one. We The first alien is Dupe or Ditto, whatever you guys want to call him. 
He is really small. His first ability is Punch. Second ability is Clone. It spawns in a clone of him. And when you're uh, killing things or like hit things, this is the alien that you want to use if you want to get away. His third ability is Super Sense. And the clone will disappear when you're not in dupe form. It will in three seconds. Um, so next one. Yeah, so there it goes. He used a dog for this trick, so that's the illusion. Okay, here we go. Next one is Ben Mummy. Ben Mummy's three abilities are Punch, Grabble, and... Yeah, whatever that ability is. Hold on, let me see. Bandage, grappling. Okay. Third alien of in the second slot, in the third slot. Selection is way big. So let me turn up this real quick. My vision to this, because he is big. He is way big. Here is way big. He is big. This dude is huge, bro. I can't tell you how huge this. Man. I think he's like skyscraper uh, high. I guess how high is a skyscraper again? That's how tall it way big is. His first ability is punch. Second ability is missile. His laser attack. His third ability is laser. And that's it for a bit. And let me turn back my vision back to normal. There we go. Norm. Okay, so. Uh oh, lag. I hate lag. Stop it, lag. Stop it. Next slot is slot three. Next alien is Clockwork from Ben 10 Multiverse. When Ben and his younger self switch bodies. And they both linked the Omnitrix, and that's how he got Clockwork. Clockwork's first ability is Punch, and he can change daytime to nighttime back to daytime. His next ability is Laser. He shoots lasers. Then he makes a, a time shield, and he'll um, make that things that grow, like grass or something, move faster in time. Next alien, if it'll let me. Thank you, Omnitrix. Okay, never mind. Okay. Next aliens, if you guys can see it, this better is Arctic Iguana. The next one is Spit, then Eon, then Feedback. Those are the last aliens that I can show you. The Alien Force Omnitrix. So here we go. Fifth one, Arctic Iguana. Three more to go. Arctic Iguana is best by water because he can use his ice abilities. First ability is Punch, Ice Ball, and Blow. And what Blow does, it blows back enemies and freezes them. Ice Ball uh, freezes enemies and freezes ice. And his shift ability lets him freeze water while he walks on it. So, yeah. Hold up. Let me just time out real quick. I'm having struggle. I'm having struggle. Omnitrix, stop it. I'm having so much lag. Stop it. 
So let me show you this one is spit it. You can uh, do the same thing as us chuck, I guess. That's the way you can explain spit. Then next is Eon. If you guys watch Multiverse, you guys know what he is. His ability is Time. So he has Punch, Energy Ball, and Time. He can change time. Next is Feedback, my favorite. Alien of all. So Feedback is an electric type alien. He's not Pokemon. His first ability is a diamond sword that lets him electric people by punch. His next ability is electricity and he can fly. While shifting, you guys can uh start up. Um, If you guys don't have redstone, this guy will be the guy to use for your redstone contraptions. Because he's the one who can turn it on. Yay, I got through that one pretty quick. If you guys could say. So, to get the alien force arm tricks, it's really simple. Remember when I was guys to save your line die? Now, what you guys need to do is with the line die. So if you turn, turn 